Emmanuel. My name is Mrs. Osaro Adasi. The problem that brought me to Synagogue Church of All Nations was um, a blotting of the stomach. My stomach was so big and uh, for eight years I've been married, no issue. So the stomach came out as though I was pregnant. So I came here with that problem. Because of that, my husband left me. On Monday last week, I happened to be privileged to have the wristband. So as I put the wristband on my hand, I fell under the anointing. And uh, the evil spirit started speaking. My time manifesting out of my mouth and was saying all sorts of things. She's my priestess. She has to work for me. She's very stubborn. She says she wants to work for God. She must work for me. She's my priestess. I have followed her right from her mother. She's my priestess. She has to work for me. But she is very stubborn. Each time I favor her, she go back to the house of God. She says, there's a spirit that raised somebody from the dead, taking her mother body. Each time she says that, I leave her. She goes to the house. <laughs> so you can see the evil spirit speaking out right now from this sister. Tell us, what have you done to destroy her? I have rendered her finances useless. I press it. No baby can stay in there. Saying what the evil spirit was saying out of me, that they spoiled my marriage, hindered my finances, and took all my virtue away from me. So I was manifesting under the Holy Spirit. Then it did not stop there. After that deliverance, I went back to the hostel where I'm staying. When I got there, something started shaking inside my stomach. It was so serious that I had to run to the bathroom. Before I knew it, I started throwing up. Some slimy whitish things started coming out of my, my mouth. It was up to the half of the bucket. It did not stop there. In the evening again, I started having a runny stomach. I pushed and pushed and pushed the Tuesday morning. Then in the night, I had a dream. I was in the front of some elders. And I saw the man of God standing in front of them as if they were in form of judgment. The one of the elders was holding a baby boy. And the man of God took the baby boy and handed the baby back to me. There was a roll call, and my name was mentioned, and I shouted, Emmanuel, I am healed, I am saved, I am delivered, and I am blessed. Praise the Lord. Before now, people call me, Mama Ejime, even five days ago, somebody called me and said, Madam, have you put to bed? You know, for you to know how embarrassing it was. But you can see my stomach now, it has gone down. And this was the picture that snapped on the 7th of November, showing how big the, the stomach was on the picture. That's me. There. This is the stomach. Okay, let's see the present stomach now, your stomach. Can you see? It's flat. <laughs> let's see the picture again. Let's see the picture. Please, let's see the picture. This is the stomach. This is the picture. Yes, it was snapped on the 7th of November. This one is me here. That's last Tilimon. Presently, last, what happened two weeks ago was bigger than this. This is me here in the picture that was snapped on the 7th of November last year. I thought I was pregnant. People even started congratulating me. Thank God, madam. Ma do you mean you two thought you were pregnant? Yes, I thought I was pregnant because I used to feel kicking. You, you used to feel kicking? Yes, sir. In your stomach? Yes, sir. Did you go to the doctor? Yes. What, I, what did the doctor say? I went to the doctor. The doctor told me that I should go and do scan. When I brought the scan, he said I wasn't pregnant. But I went to a midwife who told me I was pregnant, that she could feel it. Who? A midwife. I said doctor. <laughs> I did not know that it was a disease. Can you read read the, the letter? The letter in the wristband. Read it. Read it. It said, receive more of whatever you give today 
In Jesus' name. I want to believe that you give so much love and uh, you give so much help. Help and be helped. So when you, when you help your fellow brothers, love, kindness, the Lord will give you in abundance. Hallelujah. So that's it. Look at what the Lord has done by deliver her. She's free. The stomach is down and uh, she should be ready to get married. I said, get ready to get married. Yeah, thank you, sir. Thank you, Jesus. So thank you. Thank you.